just over two weeks ago, Destroy Lonely released his debut studio album called If Looks Could Kill. I enjoyed it a lot more than I thought I would. There's a lot of tracks on there, I'm not gonna lie, did it have to be like five hours long? Like overall solid project. So what I'm going to be trying to do today is emulate the sound and try and make something similar. For my reference track, I think I'm going to be using If Looks Could Kill. All right, we're going to need some sort of like main guitar melody. So let me see what I can come up with. For this beat, I'm going to be using the Electric Darkness preset in Electric Sunburst. Now I think I'm going to add another guitar, so I'm just going to clone this. I think I'm getting somewhere. I'm gonna have to edit the notes because I can't play piano for shit. All right, I'm gonna put some chords underneath as well. I don't know what this is. I think it's a lead, it sounds pretty good, so I'm gonna use it. All right, all right, okay. All right, now I'm going to add a bass guitar. I'm just going to add some slides to add variation to the bass line. Alright, now to bring it all together, I'm going to mix the melody and add some vocal chops and accents and stuff like that. I'm gonna reverse this one, I think. All right, I need one more, I think. Oh, that is crazy. What is that? That is so cool. Okay. Just in case people are asking in the comments, the one shot kit I'm using is Kill September Mercury Volume 3 one shot kit. I'm going to add like a really like stereotypical Benny X type bass on this. Alright, let's see what the melody sounds like. I 
I don't know what kind of drums I'm gonna use for this actually. Alright, I noticed in some of the tracks on this album, there's not actually a kick sample, so I might just not add a kick. Even though that sounds kind of messed up, I don't know, I'm so used to adding a kick to all my beats, so... It's basically done, so I just need to mix and arrange the beat. All right, in the reference track that I'm using, the drums come in almost instantly, so I think I'm going to do that as well, because why not? Alright, I think I'm pretty happy with that. I think I succeeded in slightly emulating the reference track. I'm not sure, you're gonna have to let me know. I think I could have tweaked the bass line a little bit to make the beat sound a bit darker. Hopefully if you're trying to make something similar to this, this video provided some sort of inspiration. And if you enjoyed the video, feel free to like and subscribe. Let's just listen to the beat and see what I could have done better for next time. Go, go, go through. <laughs>